I'm Sasha. I'm working as a game designer on the Velvet Assassin game. The game is set in World War II and our main character, Violet Summer, is inspired by a British war hero. The game is about destroying the Nazi forces by working behind the enemy lines. That's one part of the mission. The other part of the mission is uh, taking out like, fuel depots, sabotaging submarines and these kind of secret missions. The lighting and coloring of the game is to, to give the game a more an illustrative and expressive look because we think we can transport the atmosphere of the time and the horror of the whole place. The new thing we have in the game, it's a full real-time solution for the lighting and now the player can hide in dynamic shadows and not anymore in fixed shadows. This is something that normally you don't have in a sneaking game. What she's doing, having adventuring, killing Nazis, kind of nasty stuff for a woman. A pretty woman doing nasty stuff is kind of appealing for boys. Even if we are trying to make it, of course, beautiful and main character, we are not going for, you know, a tits monster or something like that, or an ass monster. The developers, mostly the men here, but also the, the women, uh, developed a really strong uh, connection to the character because she died in the war, she was beautiful, she did dangerous missions, she was able to handle weapons. Everybody really loves her and uh, I guess we are bring a character to life that the rest of the world will also love. Hey,